Good morning, everyone. Good morning. Wake up, Jeremy. Come on. Um, out garage sound. A cool, brisk morning. Still wearing shorts. Not that cold. Uh, hit up. This garage show over here, they have probably done it, I don't know, five times at least. I think I've been to it. Usually don't have video games. Um, they had a copy of Wii Play and a, I think, a Wii Fit. Didn't pick up those. I asked, any other games? And then she pulls out of the garage a PS4 title. <laughs> that was kind of weird, but uh, Tomb Raider Definitive Edition for five bucks. And what'd you get, Jeremy? Two Mr. Rogers DVDs. <laughs> Won't you be my neighbor? Yeah, this one's hosted. It's a documentary hosted by Michael Keaton. Ooh, I, I like Michael Keaton. He's one of my favorite peoples. And then uh, <laughs> the little sweat. It has a little trolley on the little yeah, zipper there. It's adorable. It's very cute. On to more sales. Ooh. Looks like uh, Jeremy has found some vinyl records. One of his uh, favorite things to acquire at a garage sale, the flea market. That whole table over there is nothing but vinyl records. Oh, you know. What was that, Jeremy? Girls Rock the Boys. Girls Rock the Boys. What did we get? Quiet Riot. Yeah, Thompson Twins. Ooh. English Beat. Sesame Street. Ah, Ooh, it's shiny. I like that one. Yeah, it's pretty dope. Is it a 10th anniversary on it? Yeah. Wow. It has like a little eight by ten. How much? How much were they? A dollar each. Dollar a piece. Oh, those are cool. Are they signed? Yeah. <laughs> it says on the thing. It says uh, twelve autographed photos. Who? Sweet. For framing. Right over there, not there, but right over there. Uh, picked up the Crypt Keeper. He talks. Let's do. It. Do it again. Do it again. Boils and ghouls. He's spooky. Uh, how much was he, Jeremy? One doll hair. Well, he has more than one doll hair. Oh, one dollar. I <laughs> uh, asked if they had any games. They said uh, no, but they think they left some in a box somewhere. It turns out it was a uh, turntable for DJ Hero. No games. So Two turntables and a microphone. Sure, let's go. For uh, three bucks, just picked up Animal Crossing on the Wii, City Folk. Um, right over here at this garage show, they said that they also have some more games coming. Uh, the guy will be here in about 10 minutes, so we're going to loop around this neighborhood and see if we can find some more sales and then come back here. Quick little pickup from this sale. We got Crimson Skies. Unfortunately, the uh, cover art's a little messed up there. And Pac-Man World 2. A little sticky. Uh, 50 cents each. Jeremy? Whoa. Okay. That's a nice face you got there, buddy. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, we came back to uh, this sale right over here, the one that said they had some games, Ooh. and they would bring them. 360 controller, recharge battery, there's a 360 in here with no cables, there's a Wii in here with no cables, a GameCube off-brand controller, there's a, uh, where is it? Somewhere in here, maybe it's getting crushed. Are you down there, buddy? There it is, hold on. There's a uh, iPod <laughs> with a uh, charger, it's a 2 gig. Ooh. That one's huge. And then these were thrown into it. We have Minecraft, Story Mode, and Sonic Generations. It was 10 bucks for the whole thing because these didn't have cables and everything. So that's a deal. My uh, favorite pawn shop to deal with, Pawn Max, picked up Monster Hunter Generations for five bucks. Uh, in there is also a. Where'd it go? Oh, just fell out. <laughs> Wipeout, uh, 20. What number is that? Hold on. 2048. Uh, we're almost there. Um, for the Vita, we got Angry Birds Trilogy, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, uh, Mut Mutants in Manhattan, Pac-Man and the Ghostly Adventures on Wii U, Sonic Lost World Wii U, and a 3DS XL. This was 45 bucks. This whole pile was 25 for a total of $70 altogether. That's a deal. It is a deal. That's your catchphrase right there. And uh, Eric, Eric Clapton, Clapton concert. Guitar Festival. Wait, keep holding. Crossroads. Beautiful cover. How much? One doll hair. A dollar. You're gonna jam to the oldies with your daddy? No, I, I can't even name a Clapton song. Oh. <laughs> what you got in the bag there, little buddy? Fucking score. I had to. I had to borrow some money from Jeremy for this. Yeah. Uh, some Super Nintendo games and a Super Nintendo and some good ones like Double Dragon, <laughs> Rock and Roll Racing, Zombies Ate My Neighbors, Donkey Kong Country, Donkey Kong Two. Thirty bucks. Give it. Give a deal. Come on, it's a deal. <laughs> I'll go through the rest of the games. There's a few more in there uh, that we didn't show when I get home. But uh, yeah, that's, uh, this qualifies for for epic level. I mean, thirty bucks yeah. for like probably two hundred dollars worth of Super Nintendo stuff. Jeremy scored something, and I picked up a Wii. Complete fifteen bucks. Jeremy, what'd you get? 
Family Guy song. Family, it says, uh, let's go, go drink. drink. We can't feel feelings anymore. <laughs> Do you want to not feel your feelings anymore, Jeremy? Hey. Five bucks on that. Not bad. Right after I uh, bought the Wii, someone was returning this to them because the power cable's wrong in there. It's a slim PS2 with a bunch of eh games. I got it for uh, eight bucks. That's they, a deal. They returned it for oh. $15. I didn't know it was eight bucks. Yeah, eight bucks. <laughs> Swung by Cash America, picked up only two items this time. A SP with no charger and a Lego Batman 3 for a total of $19 and one dollar change. It's time for everyone's favorite segment. Papa Stubbs, disappointed faces as Jeremy shows. That won't what, be hard because I'm fucking tired. <laughs> He's really tired. Uh, what first thing? What would we get? Uh, family Guy sign. Ooh, it lights up. That's all right. Five bucks goes yeah. for like what fifty? Yeah. Ain't too bad. Let me reach in and grab something. What we got in there? Disappointment. That's what it looks like. <laughs> okay. Mr. Rogers. Right. Show some fucking respect. Look at uh, Mr. Rogers. What's wrong with him? Fred Rogers. Oh, come on. My 23 year old son's buying Mr. Rogers shit. <laughs> 24. Eric Clapton. That's what I said, 24. <laughs> Eric Clapton concert DVD. They were like, what, two bucks on the Rogers? And then a dollar for Clapton. Look at that. Okay, it comes with like signed 8 by 10. We're going down, you know, the, the Mr. Rogers is for like, what, five year olds? This is for like three year olds. Yeah, Quiet Riot. And Feel the Noise later. Come on, Feel the Noise. And Thompson twins. These are all a dollar each. Are those approved? Cool. They're not cool bad. Shit. Thompson twins, yeah. Anything else, Jeremy? Crypt Keeper. You know, don't call your dad the Crypt Keeper. Aww. Jesus. <laughs> I thought that was Scott's. Uh, no, no. Picked up Crypt Keeper for what, a dollar? Yeah. That's pretty sick. Wait, wait, listen, wait, wait. He laughs. That's spooky. Yeah, very if scary. If it starts making noise while I'm sleeping, this thing's going in the garbage. <laughs> Well, anyways, um, I have more stuff to show you inside. We'll do the wrap-ups portion of the game giveaway and stuff uh, in a few moments. But let's say bye to the Stubbids. Bye. This is definitely going to be a count the yawns <laughs> kind of I'm video. I'm so tired. Katie's here. Hi. Uh, it's been a few weeks. Actually, it's been over a month, I think, Ooh. due to me being gone and you working late doing, like, Halloween nights at the zoo. Creatures of the night. Yes, yes. But uh, she's very tired. I woke her up, basically. She was sleeping on the couch to do this. A so, bit. so count the yawns. Anyways, um, before we get to the game giveaway for this episode, just to recap, um, I took the PS2 Slim and the games I got with that little bundle uh, to Eminem Games. I take... What are you doing? Uh, I, I go there all the time. I mention them. Eminem Games. Go check them out if you ever in... Uh, Pinellas County, there's a bunch of stores. Um, I took that, I took the 360 and the Wii with no cables, I took the complete Wii and the extra controllers. For all of that, I got 106 bucks. It was like less than $30 I spent on all that stuff, um, and I used that <clears throat> to get one game that I think is in this bag, hopefully, uh, and then I still have some credit, so um, that's the update on why I, I'm not showing that stuff or, you know, where, where that stuff it's is. Gone. It's gone! Anyways, uh, let's do the random game giveaway. Random game giveaway. Katie, can you grab your sleepy little friends over there? Apparently they're napping as well. Sleepy. Mr. Tickle and Stupid Snaggle Fruits. Don't use them as a pillow. Is that the drum roll? No. Wow, what a boring drum roll. Anyways, <laughs> let's get this started. The winner of this week's random game on what a forever system they want is newbie beastie congratulations please 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 just send me a message either here don't do that either here on youtube or on the facebook fan page preferably the facebook fan page oh. uh there we go and um let me know your shipping address and what system you want the random game for and i'll have that mailed off in the future i am behind i've been super busy you should know that by now come on um, anyways, but they'll be sent out in the near future. And hey, guess what? What? There's the cat over there. See it? It's right, oh, right there it is. No, no, that's not what I was going to say. There is a game giveaway starting right now. All you have to do is be subscribed, thumbs up this video, and leave a comment down below. Comment can be about whatever you want, but do you have a suggestion, Katie? What, what, what should they comment? Um, I want to hear some really good jokes. Good joke, okay. Yeah, like cheesy jokes. If you have a good joke or a bad joke, whatever, leave it down below. What K kind of bagels fly? I don't know, what? 
plain bagel. There you go. So that bad. That's the low I level. Love it. You can go either. Anyways, she can use them at I work. Do, yeah, yeah, I do like funny jokes. Everybody's like, would anybody else have anything? And I say, <laughs> I have a joke. <laughs> Comment can be about whatever you want, though. What'd you get this week? Blah, blah, blah. But funny jokes. Anyways, jokes. leave your uh, comments down below and just be subscribed. Thumbs up this video. You have until 11.59 Eastern Standard Time to enter this coming Friday. And uh, the winner is always announced in the following pickups video. All right. I don't know what that was. That was a cut to the next part of this video. What am I going to say next? Yep, um, this uh, one pickup that you did not see on camera, this was the last pawn shop we went by. Uh, they had these a few weeks ago when I was there. They originally wanted 15 a piece, and I passed on them. Um, I got them... F Wait, don't fucking hide it! That was a yawn. You better have counted that one. Um, <laughs> I got Pokemon Snap and Pokemon Stadium, a total of $12, so it was 6 bucks a piece. They're... They don't usually, this pawn shop doesn't usually have retro games, so I think they got them. I was like, ooh, $15, maybe we can get that. And they sat there for over a month, and then I was like, hey, I want them now for like five bucks. I want them for five, they did six, so um, not a bad deal still. And they're both in pretty clean condition. They need to do another Pokemon Snap. Yeah, yeah. That was, I love it. They missed their chance on the Wii U, now yeah. they have their chance on the, uh, Switch. On the Switch, so it might happen. This was the game oh. I picked up. Yeah. Another Pokemon on the 64. Mm -hmm. Picked up Pokemon Stadium 2 with that trading credits at M&M. Um, I wanted, I thought they had a complete Rule of Rose with the soundtrack CD with the sleeve. Mm -hmm. I don't have that stupid cardboard sleeve for the soundtrack CD. I wanted that. Turned out it was just the game with cover art, no manual. They thought maybe one of their other stores had it and they, they didn't, so... I was going to use my credit to go towards that, but... Um, anyways, this was the, the score of the day, the epic find of the day, the reason why this video, I'm allowed in my mind to call it an epic day because of this. Uh, 30 bucks, you saw some of these, um, zombies, zombies ain't my neighbors. My neighbor. They're kind of dirty, um, they definitely are going to need a cleaning, but for the most part, I think most of them should work. Zombies ain't my neighbors. Super Double Dragon. They look good, like, on the outside. Yeah, the outside looks good, just the boards are a little, like tarnished. Donkey Kong 2. Inspect them, Katie. Make funny faces. I don't think they look that bad. Uh, yeah. Do Donkey Kong Country <laughs> 1. Got some label damage. Um, kind of an oddball one. I don't know if I've ever really had this one, but Top Gear 3000. If I did, it would have been a long time ago when no one probably cared about this particular game. Um, but it's it's not like a, a you know two dollar game. It's it's up there a little up there in price. There's uh, an alien. There is an alien. Super Mario All Stars, Super Mario World, and a copy of Rock and Roll Racing. Is that it? How many cards is that? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven? Yeah. Okay. Thought there. Oh, you know what? Never mind. There was there was one more game in there. It's a Super Mario World just by itself, but it's over on the counter. I forgot that one was in the worst condition. Yes. I know. I, I took that out it wasn't to actually. Wasn't even worthy to touch the other. Game. No, it was really gross. Who's gonna infect them? So there's eight games that were in there. Um, a Super Nintendo with just a power cable. No, no controller. Uh, no RF um, or composite. You can set those down somewhere. I'm trying to. Just don't throw them. I'm trying to. I'll set that over here. Here's the super. Um, so basically, it was talk to the guy. These weren't out for sale. Brought him out. Um, he had a friend that moved away that they used to do like trades back and forth, um, which is sort of why I think these are like such good titles and there was no junk because he had said that over the years they kind of had traded or gotten rid of the ones that they really didn't care about. He says, I know, you know, these are some of the more desirable ones. Um, since the system didn't have, like, the hookups, he had another system that was complete that he was keeping to use, and he kept, like, a couple games for it, um, but for 30 bucks, I was very happy to get those, and I, I think also the price kind of was determined on the overall condition of, like, like I said, the boards on the inside were all kind of really funky, it doesn't look like they, maybe they've been used a whole lot recently, maybe his friend moved away a long time ago, I don't know, fantastic deal, it's like $200 worth of Super Nintendo crap for 30 bucks, and I can get a controller. What do you call a dog with no legs? It doesn't matter. He's not going to come anyways. Anyway, <laughs> moving on. Um, we have a few more pickups. This was a present. I love it. This came from Sprinkles. so happy. <laughs> 
It's boobs! Boo! No. <laughs> I didn't honestly know where that was going for a second. I was like... You see his face? Yeah, rewind that. Watch that. Uh, I might put that in slow-mo, <laughs> So, anyways, um, this is from Sprinkles. Sprinkles, thank you. Love y'all, Sprinkles. He sent us a card that the kind of says, I mean, boo. Mm -hmm. What was I thinking? Boo. Happy Halloween. He knows that I really don't do much for Christmas, so he's like, I'm going to send you guys your... For Halloween people. Yeah, your Christmas presents for Halloween. So he did. And it was so nice. I got... Here, you can, you can show yours. Okay. I got <laughs> the thing puzzle, which... I don't want to put it together, but... Yeah, cats and puzzles don't mix very well, but it's a thousand piece puzzle. We'll figure out some place to put it together. It, looks so cool. it is. I love uh, that art. That's awesome. Favorite movie of all time is the 80s version of the thing. What'd you get? Crafting with cat hair. Look, and there's, we can just peel some right off here. And, and you like roll it out yeah. and you make like, um, oh, what's my favorite? The boxes. So but you can make like little. I don't know, ca phone cases? Yeah. Basically really creepy crap. Creepy crap. Oh, I'm going to make you something. Oh, great. Well, make Oh, no, here it is. I want to make a knick-knack box. And what are you going to keep in it? Cat hair? <laughs> no. We can keep all our cat's fur balls. Anyways, thank you, Sprinkles. Thank very you. <laughs> very cool gifts. Very, uh... Unique and thoughtful gifts there. Yes. Um, I, now we need, since he likes Christmas, we need to get him a Christmas present. Oh, finger puppet. Little finger puppets? That's weird. Yeah. yeah. All right. <laughs> I, I, I'm waiting to see some, what comes of that. Um, then these other two pickups were uh, tr both trades? Trades? Yes, both of these are trades. One was from my friend Raven, who was on one VGS episode one time. He had a Freddy Krueger claw. He was like the thumbnail for the video. Uh, well, it was a, it was a mm, power glove yeah. that he had made into a Freddy Krueger claw. Mm, tongue twister. Um, I traded him a... Uh, now I'm going to toxic at Crusaders or Avengers? Crusader. Pretty that sure. The NES one's the Crusader. Anyways, um, traded him that game and some future credit. He's like, eh, I don't care. Maybe I'll, I'll get something down the road. So... Uh, I made out on this deal. Thank you, Raven, uh, at least for the time being. Um, we got a Pokemon Sapphire, a Fire Red, and a Leaf Green, all authentic, not from China. Uh, a Game Boy Color uh, Teal version with the battery door back there. A copy of Draken on Super Nintendo. A copy of Might and Magic 3. What's the uh, Isles of Isles of Terra is the subtitle. A Breath of Fire Uno. Oh, come on. Lagoon. Yeah, yeah tilt it this way. There we go. Uh, Lufia, the first one on Super. And last but not least, Alone in the Dark with some stickers on the cover. Um, I loved this game when it came out. Being that era of like uh, Resident Evil and Silent Hill, um, this was a little different. Um, different vibe, but you, you you failed. You dropped it. Anyways, um, <laughs> this was uh, entertaining for the sense of like the pre-rendered backgrounds were so detailed and just I had so much fun shining my flashlight. I have to watch her. Um, all over like the backgrounds and just seeing like the, all the little things that were there. Um, but Alone in the Dark unfortunately has kind of died. It died on the 360 and PS3. Rest in peace Alone in the Dark. Come back. Come back to us. Uh, let's see, two more things. This, oh darn it, I didn't look, I forgot to look up the name. I apologize. But we're gonna call you, uh, Ghibli Goo. Ghibli Goo did a trade with you. And it was, I traded the box for Final Fantasy III, just the box, the manual for Final Fantasy DOS, and two NES carts. One was a Tengen one, uh, ten, Tengen, not Tengen, sorry. And, uh, that was... Fantasy Zone, and there was one more game, and it was a uh, Kid Nicky. Having I did memory it. problems. No, I remembered them all, and I said them. They were just slowly over time. Uh, here, you speak, because you haven't said much recently. Mega Man X. And... Zombies <laughs> Eat My Neighbors! <laughs> Two copies Again. this week. Uh, then... Castlevania 
Four? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Roman numerals. Come on. Oh, it, it, from out here, it could be three. Roman numeral, uh, Castle IV? I don't know. <laughs> Working at a game store and hearing <laughs> the... Do you, what I mean? <laughs> do you have Grand Theft Auto V? <laughs> nope, sure don't. Uh, and then last up, a complete copy of Advanced Dungeons and Dragons Dragon Strike. Uh, I know I need, I still need a copy. Oh, I think it's a yawn. Okay. Uh, I need a copy of Hills Far, but I have this and the other cheaper one um, in boxes now. So, thank you very much. What did I call them? Goobly Gee? I think that was uh, something like that. Anyways, comment down below so I can <laughs> say thank you on a video in that sense. Uh, and then, last up, this one has a note. Uh, couple, now, this is like two turbo related pickups within a short period of time. Dun, dun, dun. I know. Uh, Scott Squatch, hope you enjoy, yada, yada, yada. Uh, this is from Jordan, and the key point of this note is, P.S., if this makes it to a pickups vid, shout out my brother Scotty Smalls. He doesn't believe me, laugh out loud. So, Scotty Smalls. Scotty Smalls. This is Scotty Fuzzy. Squatch. <laughs> Scotty Squatch. And, uh, <laughs> I don't like that. Scotty Squatch, no. Or Scott Squatch. Um... Picked up Samurai Ghost. It really happened. Jordan wasn't lying to you, apparently. Um, it's This is just the box. I have the game and the manual. Uh, Jordan sent me a picture two months ago now, almost, a month and a half ago, of all these boxes for Turbo Games in really nice shape, in this good of condition. And I'm like, wow, that's a great pickup. He's like, they're all just boxes. The guy had already sold off his games. He had already sold off the systems. He got all the boxes super cheap. I think it was like 70 or 80 bucks. But like I said, there was a ton of boxes. So I ended up picking this one up from him for 60 bucks. Um, I, I love Turbo. And most of my Turbo games are complete in box like this. So anytime I'm like, oh, I need that box. Please, please let me get it. And he did for monies. I think that's it. The money. Not a whole lot, but that Super Nintendo find uh, was was well. This was a Super Nintendo video. Almost everything here. There's. Yeah. Uh, uh, I got. It. Let's pick them up. We can do this. I got it. And then where's the other ones? I mean, look at this. This is a nice little array of Snooper games. So uh, thank you very much for watching. Please enter the game giveaway. All you have to do, remember, be subscribed, thumbs up the video, leave a comment down below. Any uh, final jokes you want to give us? Why don't lions eat clowns? Because they taste funny! <laughs> oh! I just said that one recently. That's the only reason I knew it. Maybe. What do you call a cow with no legs? Um, we're done. No, no more. Uh, I don't know. Ground beef. Ground beef. Congratulations. Anyways, uh, love you all. Talk to you later. Peace! Peace.